In today's challenge, we are going to extract the last recorded inventory level for each product. Sounds tricky? Not if you've got the right moves. Let's dive in. First things first, we need to get our data into Power Query. This is where the fun part begins. Let's start by using Group By option. It's much more powerful than it looks. We are going to use it to group our products, but here is the trick. Instead of the usual sum or count, change the operation to all rows. Why? Because we are going to unleash some Power Query magic. Now check this out. We've got nested tables for each product. Let's give our new column a proper name and delete all the extra stuff after the underscore symbol. Alright, here comes a slick move. Put your cursor right after the underscore, open up the figure brackets and type 0. Boom, you've got the first record of each table. Next up, let's convert that record into a list with the record to list function. Lists are easier to work with. Oh, and we are not stopping there. Use list remove nulls to delete all null values. Now for the grand finale. Use list last to snatch the last value from our list. Just like that. We've got the final inventory level for each product. Mission accomplished. Until next time, see ya!